Hey folks, welcome back. You got the Hell Deep Digger here, and I'm in the greater Seattle metro area in a park on the east side. I've um, metal detected this small park here before. Um, kind of um, was unsuccessful. I actually hate to admit it, but I was skunked. And so uh, that was this last summer. So now I'm going to go ahead and um, you know, give it another try when there's nobody around. It's early November. Actually, it's in the middle of November. Uh, it's a little bit cold, but I got some sun between the rain breaks. And, uh, you know, you, you really love metal detecting when, when you try to find, uh, you know, a time in your schedule, maybe 30 minutes, maybe an hour of where you can get that next hunt in. So, you know, bear with me. Again, you got the Hell Deep Digger here. And uh, I'm going to have at it, and let's see what we can do. All right, on to the next one. All right, looks like my first find is a zipper. It was coming up uh, as a 4849 on the Garrett AT Pro. Um, you know, I, I, you really need to dig those because that's where jewelry is. That's where gold is. Um, unfortunately, this time, it seems to be just a zipper end. All right, well, let me see if I can get a closer zoom in on that. There you go. Junk in the park, middle of November, in the tot lot. All right, on to the next one. All right, getting a 76 on the Garrett AT Pro. That could be a penny or it could be silver. Uh, let's take a look at what I got. Stand by. like a shield penny shield penny there you go 76 on the Garrett ET Pro Let's see if I can get a better shot at that there it is eh, you know we all go through it from time to time. This uh, tot lot seems to be pretty clean. But, uh, you know, if they're losing pennies, that means they're losing other things. So, on to the next one. All right, looks like I'm getting an 88, 87 signal on the Garrett AT Pro. Uh, it could be a clad quarter. Let's uh, go ahead and check it out. Stay tuned. Six eighty seven. Oh, looks like we got some bling. That looks like somebody just dropped this. Oh, it's a money clip. Nice! Nice! Oh, yeah! God damn, yes! 925, right there. Hold on, let me get a... Let me get a close-up of this. Yes, there we go. 925 money clip. Not in bad condition at all. A little dirt on it, some scratches, but it looks like it's been a recent drop. 
hasn't been here for a while only had about two inches of bark over it so nice and that's what I like about silver it doesn't really tarnish it'll turn black but that is a nice money clip right there all right that's the second money clip uh, the second sterling money clip that I've, I found the first Harley Davidson paraphernalia I found my buddy my next door neighbor found a lighter and it was uh, 925 as well all right cool so nice I'm on the board with silver this is the hell deep digger on to the next one okay uh, you got the hell deep digger here and I'm out in the country uh, Washington State Western Washington uh, King and Pierce County and there's a field that I'm going to be detecting in here um, I've only been here once there's an old barn up on the hill there Let's see if I can get uh, uh, a little close proximity there there we go and, and above that there's a, a an old park it used to be uh, way back in the 40s um, a distribution center for uh, logs and whatnot um, but the whole place here just kind of uh, again out in the country um, actually at the property line right now right there by the gate and there are some homes on top of the hill way back way up there but uh, I'll go ahead and uh, expand out about ready to go into the prop property I do have permission and uh, this goes back this field goes back into the uh, early 30s late 20s and I'm hoping that um, I'll be able to find something good so stay tuned and another uh, episode uh, with yours truly the hell deep digger all right okay I'm back got the hell deep digger here I've abandoned the hill the field on the hill um, I did get a lot of finds on there. I didn't, um, they're not on this particular video. A lot of iron relics and a few goodies. I'm going to put those in a special uh, video at the end of the year. But uh, I'm here in another park um, in the Seattle metro area in South King County. And I'm going to go ahead and detect this and we'll see what we've got. All right, stay by or stand by. Okay, I'm getting a uh, mixed signal, um, high 60s, low 70s. I'm going to go ahead and dig this one live and uh, see what we can come up with. All right, stand by. Zoom in on that for you. And there we have it. Your common brass key. I don't know how many I've dug up this year. 60, 70. But uh, yeah, high 60s, low 70s, nice looking key. All right, on to the next one. All right, my next signal is an 81, 82. Uh, this is typically where a clad dime would come in. It's uh, two to three inches on the Garrett AT uh, Pro. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and dig this one live. Please stand by.
looks like I'm getting some rust. Could be some metal. to the best of us. On to the next one. Nothing too spectacular there, folks. Sorry about that. Like I said, on to the next one. Okay, I'm getting an 82-83 on the Garrett AT Pro, about uh, three inches down. I'm going to go ahead and dig this one live as well and see what we can come up with. All right, so please stand by. Take a look here, see what we have. Out comes the Garrett Pro Pointer. Huh. Looks like it's in the plug. Penny, stinking Lincoln. You gotta be kidding me, is that it? Stinking Lincoln? Oh man. Huh. Alright, well. Stinking Lincoln. I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, rescan the hole, see if I missed anything. No, that was it. One doggone stinking Lincoln. All right, on to the next one. Okay, I just got a, uh, a high uh, 8990 signal on the Garrett AT Pro, about three inches deep. I see a little bit. Uh, a little bit of color down there. Um, I did not uh, extract it, so this was again 89, 90 on the Garrett AT Pro. Uh, looks like it could be some bling, so uh, let's go ahead and take a look at it. Stand by. All right, there it is. Oh, oh nice. Nice, nice imprint there. Oh, really nice, very nice. Let's go ahead and take a look at that there. Very nice. Let's 
See if I can get a closer look at that. And I can tell already just by looking at that, that's, that's silver. That's silver. That's got to be silver. Or it could be 10K. Get my uh, camera to steady up here. Just does not want to do that. My apologies. A new camera tripod's on my Christmas wish list. Uh, looks like my batteries are going low too. Let's see if I can uh, identify what this is. Yeah, 925. 925. There we go. Looks like an Aztec calendar. Very nice. Very nice. That'll clean up really nice. All right, on to the next one. Okay, I'm getting an 82 signal. Fairly close to the uh, to the surface. I'm going to go ahead and dig this. All right, stand by. Oh man, again, nothing more than a stinking Lincoln. Yeah, this place is full of them. I don't know why my camera's not doing any real adjustments there. I'm not sure what the heck is going on with it. Come on, buddy. You can do it. Let's work. Focus. Well, I hope that's good enough. There you go. Another stinking Lincoln. All right, on to the next one. Okay, just got a uh, hit uh, about four or five inches down. Low 80s, 83, 84. Let's see what we got. Sorry, I don't have my platform um, or tripod, so I'm going to just do my best to handhold this. Huh. Oh, I see something. Oh, nice. Could be just some bling. Yes. Nice. All right. It is really nice. Let's see if I can get yes, woohoo! Yeah, that's heavy. That's heavy, right there. That's heavy. Yeah, nine two five silver. Woohoo! Yes! Alright, on to the next one. Okay, it's been about 10 minutes since I found that silver necklace. Getting a, uh, a 76, 78 signal on the Garrett AT Pro. About two inches down. Alright, stand by on this. <laughs> Oh my gosh, look at this here. It's a surface find penny. Another stinking Lincoln. Doggone it. Yeah, you win some, you lose some. Hmm. Yeah, 76, 77 on the Garrett AT Pro. Alrighty, well, gotta take the good with the bad, so on to the next one. Okay, um, I'm in a section of an old ball field where they remove the bleachers and you're just sitting right here uh, as another surface find. Looks like a clad nickel right there. 
and uh, yeah I'll take it and I don't know why my camera is not focusing in very well today I'm not sure exactly what the deal is Let's see if I can get a better shot sometimes it does that sometimes it just acts up like that again along with a new camera tripod which is totally you know out of service I'll need to think about uh, another camera and I know I've been saying that for a while I apologize to my youtubers uh, I will get a decent camera before uh, the year's over maybe from jolly old Saint Nick all right on to the next one all right and just to give you youtubers some type of idea this is um, an area where they recently pulled out the bleachers in an old ballpark as you can see this is where one set of bleachers was at one time and I don't recall or know what time they took these bleachers out but uh, they were there last month so I've been here before and uh, as you can see it's a it's a pretty good spot all right hopefully I'll find something good all right on to the next one okay I'm getting multiple signals looks like I might have a pocket spill so um, we'll uh, we're gonna check it out uh, unfortunately I don't have my tripod with me today so I'm going to just basically sh stop shoot and record whenever possible all right stay tuned okay getting an 88 signal on the Garrett AT Pro um, about four or five inches down and uh, generally clad quarters oh, it looks like it's in the plug all right Let's see if I can just move that here see what happens uh, it's a hard way to dig so I'm somewhere right there in the plug Let's see if I can feel it without shutting off the camera Now I'm going to have to stop the camera and uh, I'll show you what it is, alright? Hold on. Hey YouTubers, here's the wrap up. Um, having some technical difficulties with my camera and tripod, so please bear with me. Uh, we'll start off at the top there. Um, I ended up with the uh, those multiple winter digs uh, with 13 clad quarters which brings me up to 768 for the year. I did have a goal for 1,000 quarters, but at last check, I uh, checked my math and I uh, had an, an error. So 768 clad quarters for 2013. It's the beginning of December, so uh, it's starting to get cold and messy um, outdoors, so I don't think I'm gonna go for that record. Um, also, um, ended up with uh, oh about uh, uh, there you can count them one two three four five six seven eight uh, clad dimes and uh, three clad nickels and um, about 23 uh, stinking Lincolns so no uh, Wheaties um, a couple of uh, miscellaneous finds or grommet uh, I really don't know what that is. If anyone knows what that is, looks like a, um, I don't know, um, lead maybe. Um, well, not exactly sure what kind of material that is, but if anyone knows what that is, please give me a holler. And then, of course, the ever-present key. Um, I did go back and take a look at how many keys I found for the year. 82. 82 keys. And then uh, the grommet snap off of blue jeans uh, cleaned it up it actually had some some blue jean material still on it all right here's that pendant it's 925 it cleaned up really well Let's see if I can get uh, a, a closer shot of that again uh, camera still is acting up and it's probably because I've dropped it on a couple of occasions, but uh, I do have it on my Christmas uh, wish list, a new camera. And uh, if GoPro could ever get their uh, black edition to to run properly, um, I probably uh, will buy another one of those. 
and then there's that uh, 925 sterling uh, money clip that cleaned up really nice and then to top it off there's that uh, 20 or 18 inch 925 um, chain so let's see if I can zoom in it does a uh, it does say Italy on it yeah camera's not gonna go in that far but uh, trust me it is 925 and uh, let me zoom out and there you have it that was uh, this is the wrap up for those multiple winter hunts um, starting in uh, uh, a couple of parks there was some hill footage I did uh, manage to edit that I will have a separate video for what I found in the country on the the, the field on the hill um, but there you have it all right so you know keep that coil swinging this is the hell deep digger god bless you and happy holidays